The Guardian. Can we fight compassion figure fatigue? What are our summer job taught us? Minister's secret plan to assess role of austerity in food poverty. The government knows perfectly well there have been cuts that have hit families. And that's by design. Robinson released as court orders new trial. New trial? There wasn't a trial in the first place, so that's, like a, that's fake news. Zimbabwe army opens fire on protesters. These lot are protesting about voting when we know in this country voting doesn't make a blind bit of difference. Doesn't matter who gets in, the same controlling uh, scumbags carry on controlling everything. But at least it's starting to become known that that's what's going on. So it's, it will come to an end. Daily fail. My grandparents died at Auschwitz. Corbyn's refusal to tackle Labour anti-Semitism is a stain on Britain and an insult to their memory. No, that is an insult to our memory because it never happened. And some of you will go, well, of course it happened. You know, it says so in all the history books. His story. History, his story. And we all know the victor writes his story. Just look, look up Adolf Hitler, the greatest story never told. It's six and a half hours long, but it'll point you to some more of the real, uh, what really went on in World War II. And it was nothing like we were told. <clears throat> a devastating indictment by Alex Brummer. Addicted to our mobiles. We check our phones every 12 minutes. Six in ten couldn't live without them. Women overtake men in web use. Adults spend a day online each week. Well, I spend more than a day online, but actually on a computer, not on my phone. Don't do it. Phones are for, for, for calling others. You know, ah, oh, yeah, not or texting. None of this bullshit. I wasn't put on earth to have babies, says Jennifer. Unlucky and love, Jennifer Aniston. The Times. <clears throat> Unseen Python. Exclusive The Lost Life of Brian sketch. Delicious guide to summer eating. Moderate drinkers less likely to get dementia than teetotalers, especially if they take some coconut oil. This is how perverted the government are. Visas for men who force teenagers into marriage. Women and girls raped after being sent abroad. Home office lets illegal husbands settle in UK. Because they're all a bunch of dirty paedophiles in Parliament. Corbyn raised Nazi crimes in to describe Israel in Gaza. I absolutely agree. If it was any other country acting like Israel has done, then they would have been invaded. Mirror. Plastic surgery is like having your hair done. Idiots. Families heat wave peril. Brits 118 Fahrenheit. Whole hell. One million are warned. Beware of Europe's hottest day ever, ever, ever. We're playing that one again, are we? You know, like last Friday was the hottest day ever, 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 ever. And it wasn't. It was a load of bullshit by the papers. So we're in for more bullshit by the looks of it. Express. Half down the aisle. TV star 66 ties the knot with Well Sweetheart 38. Bobby on the beat is a thing of the past, says police chief. By design. But then again, we don't want them. We don't want them on the beat. We don't want them answering calls. We don't want them anywhere because they're just a bunch of crooks. More bullshit. Exclusive. 31 billion heatwave boost to economy. Stata stay staycation Brits part spark business boom. Parasite alert. Of course, we're not going to see any 
if there is 31 billion coming to the economy, we're not going to see any of it. Reptilian bitch named Ultimate Power Dresser. Star. Glorious at Goodwood, not really. Whole Brits face 48 degrees centigrade. This heat will kill you. Let's ramp up that fear, shall we? Danny Dad, kids ban. So, apparently, it's going to be 48 degrees. Um, it don't look like it to me. Uh, what I will say is, it's reasonable. It's not hot, it's not cold. But this headline, total fear mongering. The scum. Jen, on not keeping a man, on never having a child, on pervs in Holly of Hollywood. Her most revealing interview. Nanny state nonsense, nursery crimes, preschool slated for not spotting jihadis. Furia Jewish row jazz. It's back, 90 degrees Fahrenheit. Where are they looking? I has Cole kissed England hopes goodbye. Cricket. Farmers feel the heat. Hot weather drive up costs with Brexit fears looming. Violence erupts after Zimbabwe election. Voting doesn't make a bleeding difference as we in this country can see. Thieves escape by speedboat in Sweden with crown jewels. Far-right leader freed on bail, Tommy Robinson. The lowdown on highlighter. Labour MPs plead with Corbyn to avoid cri crisis. After weeks of damaging accusations, party leader is challenged over toxic anti-Semitism row that threatens to rip Labour apart. Corbyn apologised but faces over open revolt. <clears throat> What's it got to do with the Jews? What, what Corbyn or the Labour parties gets up to. Nothing. This is then just exu showing you that they are actually in control. The Zionists are in control. Metro. Staying single and sorted. Trends. Three lines will cut bid in 2030. But I thought these put out earlier this week that 2022 we've got that or FIFA said we could just again you can't believe a word you see in the papers because they're all lying pieces of shit look who's back Terminators Linda Hamilton returns don't know if it's in the Terminator film or not FT the big floor the crisis facing the auditing industry the Bank of England should freeze rates Unrest has poll results delayed in Zimbabwe. House of Fraser's future in doubt after China rescue plan collapses. Purchasing of controlling stake impractical. Crisis is latest blow for high street retail. <clears throat> now with these shops closing down uh, on, on the high street, it's not by accident, it's planned, it's by design. Nottingham Criminal Cartel, just like every other council, are doing their best to close the high streets down. They charge ridiculous amounts of rates. And what do they do for that? Absolutely nothing. They don't even empty the bins for these um, shops and restaurants and that. But they charge, up to, well, up to and over £60,000 a year for what? Because they're a bunch of frigging crooks that can, can do. And who are you going to report them to? The police. Well, you'll notice how on all the council fans and all the police fans, it's got Nottingham Criminal Cartel, Nottingham Corrupt Police Force, working in partnership. The partnerships need destroying. They're what's destroying this country. Google ready for bow to Beijing censor as it plots relaunch of Chinese service. Heatwave adds fire to farmers' fears on Brexit. See, they're trying to tie the sun 
<laughs> the sun into Brexit. This is how ridiculous these papers are. The only use for a paper is wiping your ass with it. And don't waste your money buying it because it's all propaganda and absolute bullshit.